Flood affected farmers in Region 7 and 8 continue to receive support from the government. Minister Sidney Alcock today updated InfoHub on the plans. Minister of Indigenous Peoples Affairs Sidney Alcock said today at a media briefing that the flood affected farmers are receiving assistance via the Civil Defense Commission and his ministry. We've been sending in like chainsaws, tarpaulins, buckets, uh, things like that. To, uh, and tools, agricultural tools. The source is to help them to build back their houses. The minister said the recent flooding in Region 9 is due to heavy rainfall in the hinterland regions and a backup of the Amazon River. We continue to gather uh, materials. Some, some of the farms, it's like within another year before they would be able to have their own farm going again, like eight, nine months to a year. Uh, so we're trying our best to see how we could be able to cope with that situation and help them as much as possible. And as you know, it's not only region 7, 8 and 9, but also region 6. We have a lot of flooding even in region 10. So um, it's, it's very, very, uh, I should say tricky, challenging. It's very challenging uh, with the limited resources, but we're doing all that we can at this moment to bring some relief to our people. When asked if any methods are being put in place to prevent such a disastrous situation in the future, the minister said that as much as the weather cannot be controlled, a better understanding and reading of weather patterns can help farmers be more prepared. Shiloni King, InfoHub.